Hi, my name's Dan. Now, at the end of the video, or just I'll tell you right now. According to uh, me, the shipping is going to be probably, I'm going to put it down a little higher. Because I'm going to take this to the shipper, which would be UPS. And I'm going to have them do the packing and the shipping. So you're going to be paying for whatever bill that they have. If what I have charged you is more than it cost, I will give you a refund of the difference. And this will be insured and done properly because I do not want nothing to happen to this piece. If you are not okay with this, go away. This piece is going to be shipped properly and by a professional, and that's not me. So keep that in mind if you make an offer on this item. Now, it appears to be some kind of either tramp art or late 1800s piece. You know, like 1880, 1870, 1890, somewhere around there. And I'm almost always 100% correct. I am Dan from Cincy Auctions. So, you know, take a good look at this item. And it's at least what I say it is. Now, I looked this over. I uh, didn't find any real damage I've seen a little wear you know on this purple it's like a dark purple velvet I think that that right there you know gives you about right there it gives you about a true color scheme right there now these horns are kind of dark because they're really really old but I, I haven't found any real problems with them yet now I measured these horns from tip to tip as you can see, I got a tip to tip. Now they're just a tad over 20 inches apart. As you see. Now I measured the wood uh, close close proximity from there to down at the bottom. Let me try to get this right. So you're talking a little tad over 15 and a half inches from the tip of the wood there. To the tip of the wood there. Now the mirror is, I'm measuring from the outside of this wood across. So as you can see, what, four and a half? Just a tad under, four and a half. And that's from the edge of the wood. That's the edge of the wood. Alright, so let's keep that in mind. Now the wood itself let me show you the back. I have not really cleaned this up. I wiped it off with a dry rag. That is all I've done. I'm afraid to get it wet. I don't want to hurt this piece. I've had this a long time and it took very good care of it. Now somebody has put this brass plate on the back so that they can hang it up. Now it has three screws in the back. I do not know which ones are original. I'd be more inclined to find this flathead screw to be more original. But, you know, these could be the original, although they look like machine screws. But, you know, hey, I don't really know. The wood seems to be a, some type of secondary wood. Okay? Now, that, my opinion, the secondary wood. And I'm usually right. So, pretty much just go by what I'm telling you. And somebody stained this a long time ago and it's kind of orange peeled. I hope that right there, right there, give you an idea. You know, I'm pulling in close. But that, that kind of shows you the finish. Now, you could probably put some kind of you know old English on there or something like that and kind of bring out the finish because I like I said I, I don't want to I don't want to touch it myself I've had this a long time and I just I just like it because it's so original and down the earth you know I'm sure you can see that it's down to earth it is so cool so you know if you're interested remember what I told you about the shipping if the shipping is not what I got listed I will refund the difference okay I'm just trying to cover the shipping 
I'm not trying to make any money. I just want to make sure that the real shipper pays for this. You know, the real shipper is going to do the shipping. So the, that has to be paid for somehow. And I'm posting that up so when you make an offer, you know, you can consider all this. But, you know, I'm, uh, I, I usually get pretty reasonable offers on my, on my items. As long as your offer is reasonable, I will accept it. Because I do believe this item is unique. And I mean unique. So, you know, take a look at it. Now this hole in the top, I have speculated on this in a long time. Because I don't have no clue what would have gone in that slot. You know, in that slot. It goes all the way through. Now if you want to, you know... Send me a message and let me know what that is. I'll, I will post that up so that people can see it. I appreciate you checking out this item and our other items. And I, I hope, that, uh, hope you like it. And at the very least, you got to see it. My name is Dan. This is Cincy Auction. 